Good morning and welcome back. It is Friday. Yay. And I have another one of my artists back in with us because there is something new and exciting happening in your life. Kelly, welcome back. Thank you for having me back. Awesome. And before we carry on, I must thank my gorgeous and wonderful sponsors. I love you guys madly. That is the diamond and the emeralds. Mwah. Thank you for making this all possible because we get to sit down and talk to you again. Now, I think it was July when we were here last. Yeah. That's right. Like near the very beginning when we yes. first started the morning show. So you can see some things have changed. <laughs> We've rearranged the furniture a little bit. Yeah, it looks awesome. And I think last time we saw your, your last music video, which was fantastic. I remember it was uh, like a shot on the beach. And yes. It's such a catchy little tune. I know I hear it around here quite often because <laughs> we all just love it. <laughs> and we Thank love you. you. Thank you. But you have a new single that was just dropped. Yes. So tell us what's been happening because it's all been very hush-hush. Yes. You were like dropping us little hints last time, but we haven't heard anything else. So I've been so excited. Tell me more. So, um, yeah, we just dropped a new single. There's three. Um, there's an acoustic version and a remix version of my new song, Dancing, mm. attached to my EP. Um, it's out everywhere. I'm very excited about it. Yeah, we've been um, working, working on it for a while, and I've been really excited to share it. But, yeah, it's finally out. <laughs> cool. Now, I remember you told me that the new one is very different. Um, in terms, obviously, you have the musicality of it, and then you have the, the music video. I mean, how did you go about making that change, and how did it happen? Well, um, in the beginning, it was just like a normal song. We didn't think much of it. Mm. Um, and then my producer said, hey, let's try and make a remix version of this song. I think it would be really cool. It works with, like, Africa, and it's, like, yeah. an embodiment of happiness and all mm. good vibes. And... Yeah, he thought, let's try and make something different, give something new to the, to the people, and we thought remix and acoustic version would be a good idea. So cool. So anybody who loves any kind of music can actually find the version of the song yeah. that they love. Now, the music video, I yes. mean, it's called Dancing, and yes. you are <laughs> legit dancing. Yeah. Do you have much experience dancing, or was this new for you? I did. I used to do hip-hop classes with Sugar Rush cool. in grade three to grade four, I think. And then we got back into it for the music video, okay. which is really nice. So it's just fun. reawakening all those old oh, yeah. skills and everything. <laughs> and it looked fantastic. I'm so excited for everyone to see it. Um, and the music video itself, did it take a while to put it together? And all the practicing and the shooting and everything? Well, the shooting took about a day. Like, we started early in the morning and then mm. we ended up, like, at 1 o'clock or maybe 2 o'clock. Mm. But, like, the whole process it honestly wasn't long but it was so much fun to do like yes. the dance rehearsals seeing the dance um, uh, rehearse for the first time and trying it out it was so much fun it makes a difference when you enjoy what you're doing definitely. yeah see we're lucky that way I mean I get to do this I just sit, sit and talk and have fun with the favorite <laughs> with my <laughs> favorite people it's so exciting okay now as I said earlier it was dropped uh, this morning at midnight um, how can people find you uh, you can find the music video on YouTube at Kali L, spelled C A L L I E, and my Instagram, which is C A L L I E underscore E S. Okay, you can cool. find me. And you said there was three different versions. Can we find all three versions? Yes, you can find all three versions on all live streaming platforms, including iTunes, YouTube Music, and Spotify. Okay. And right after this interview, we're going to be playing it. Um, you we're going to be hearing the, the remix, the version. Am I yeah. correct? Oh, that's so exciting. Yay. I only saw a very brief clip of it, um, and I'm just so excited for everyone to see it. Yeah. Fantastic. Is there anything else that you want to share with us before we close up? Um, yeah, please go watch the music video. It will mean a lot, a lot to me. And yeah, we're going to be hopefully making some new music and sharing it with you guys. So I hope mm -hmm. you guys enjoy it. Fantastic. And just a little sneak peek reminder for people that are watching. I believe I'm going to be having you actually back later in the month, but with the Zard. Yeah. You guys collaborated. Yes. Uh, I don't, when was that? A while ago? Yeah, it was um, for my EP. So it was and like I didn't a while actually ago. know about that, but I had Zard on here last month and he yes. mentioned it. I was like, no way. <laughs> <laughs> this is so happening and it has a music video. I'm so excited. So we're going to, and I think it's in about two or three weeks, mm. we're going to have you both on my couch and I'm so super amped because we just be love you both madly. The music that you're creating, the vibes and just carrying those good vibes with you. I mean, that's what music is all about. Yeah. That's so exciting. Thank you so, so very much for joining us. Thank you for having me. And I'm, I'm so looking forward to seeing you later <laughs> in the month. 
Thank so you. Exciting. You too. Okay, awesome, guys. Now, before we do anything else, we're going to talk about the weekend vibes. So, what is happening in the area now? When I had these these uh, gigs and everything lined up, we didn't know <laughs> that we were dropping to level one. Um, so, there's going to be a hell of a lot more fun happening this coming weekend, I think, than we had originally planned. But if you're looking for somewhere to go, starting today, we have the talent of Nolan on piano at 10 a.m. My darling friend James at 5.30 at the market. Around the corner at Eat Street, we have Sheldon de St. Pern, who we love. We had him on the show recently. If you're at Yami Ribbon Burger for the best burgers in town, we've got Esther Lloyd starting at 6.30. If you're at Hops, we've got Johnny at 5.30. Then moving on to Saturday, if you're in Lifestyle Bonito Direction, we have Graham Hudson on piano. So somebody a little bit different uh, is going to be playing the piano for us. And then um, I think as Matt already mentioned, we have the SA versus New Zealand rugby that is going to be playing, and that's going to be on the big screen um, at Lifestyle. So that's a nice family-friendly place that you can watch that. And directly after that, we have the oh-so-talented, epically-talented John Ellis. Around the corner at Eat Street, we have Rowan Stewart at 12.30. My dear friends, Hail Mary at 6 p.m. If you're in Hops, we have Eleanor at 5.30. And if you're going Hillcrest direction to the Shongweni Market, another one of, of our favorite artists here, Tanner Wareham, will be entertaining you guys there. That's a lovely family day out. Now, Sunday, fun day, everybody's favorite day of the week. <laughs> Starting at the market, another fantastic pianist, Callie Thompson, will be entertaining you in the morning. Uh, Chuck Bowden, the entertainer himself, will be in at lunchtime. Um, and each street around the corner, we have our weekly appointment with jazz, and that is starting at 1 till 4 with Quiet Storm. Um, at Hops, we have James, who we get to see quite frequently at Hops at 3 p.m. And one of my favorite things on the weekends happens at the Crusaders Club. That is the Soul Sunday Sessions. Now, if you want somewhere to go where you're really appreciating the music and you're really, really into it, you're dealing with a crowd of people that love live entertainment, it kicks off at 1.30, free entrance. Um, and we're starting with Tion. We've got the Black Lapels duo and then ending on The Fix. Now, something a little bit different that I just found out about about two days ago, happening over at Marigold. Now, Marigold always have DJs and, and all of that whatnot happening. I think they have a comedy show coming up on Friday, today as well. But on Tuesday, they have something different. They have a little art evening starting at 6 p.m. You can make contact with them to get more information on that. And that is our roundup for the course of the next few days. Now, y'all, don't go too crazy with the restrictions being lifted. Look after yourselves, mask up, sanitize, keep safe, and I will see you here next week. And another fantastic shout out to my lovely dear sponsors. Love you guys madly. I'll see you next week.